here we have a chip on board scenario where we don't know the pinout of the device. I connected the drive to a logic analyzer and triggered on some random data from a read command. Let's zoom in and see what we can find. Below is an example of read command from a NAND data sheet. We need to match up the unknown signals to known signals from the data sheet. Right from the beginning, we can tell that D3 is the read enable signal and D11 through D16 are data signals. Read enable strobes the data and the data signals are returning random information. D10 is also a data signal, however, the connection was loose on my logic analyzer, so just assume it's data too. Next, we're going to zoom out and look for the command sequence that resulted in this read. We can tell that D4 is write enable because it goes low every time data is sent to the flash drive. We can tell that D8 is the command latch because the latch is at the beginning and end of the command sequence, which is indicative of a read. ALE on D7 is a little trickier to spot because on most flash controllers, it stays high throughout the entire address input. In this case, it's going high at the input of each individual column and row address. D6 is ready busy because it goes low at the end of the final command input, indicating the NAND chip is busy and returns high when the NAND chip is available. Some flash controllers don't use ready busy, but will instead use the check status command. All right, next we're gonna look at the uh, read ID command. Um, the read ID command is uh, 90, which is right here, and address zero, which is right here. This is a really poor implementation. I'm guessing the data bus is going tri-state. I don't know. Um, yeah, so CLE, it shouldn't drop over here and then come up. Uh, so it shouldn't go low and then go high. Um, over here, read enable shouldn't drop low. And write, write enable shouldn't drop low either. And really bad design. Anyway, uh, command 90 address 0, and then um, scroll out, we'll see that uh, each read cycle over here is uh, linked to the um, ID of the chip. So the ID of the chip is 2C, which is uh, Intel slash Micron, um, D7, 94, 3E, and uh, 84. Uh, which is uh, a four gigabyte micron man chip. 